Well, Carmen, the snow is coming down at a decent pace. It actually let up for a few minutes, but just in the last 10 to 15 minutes or so, it started coming back and the flakes are a pretty decent size as well. And they just plowed this sidewalk maybe 30 minutes ago and it's already back to fully covered uh, with snow. And maybe you were like me today and you waited until the last minute to get those snow day snacks and hot chocolate. Well, we weren't alone. Stores across the state were packed with people trying to get those last minute buys before the snow moved in. Long lines and crowded aisles. People all across Connecticut rush to their grocery stores like this big Y in West Hartford to do some last minute shopping before the snow started to fall. Well, milk and eggs because that's the essentials and I think we all have plenty stocked in our refrigerators so we should be fine. Whether it was just to grab a few things or stock up on groceries, stores tried their best to keep their shelves stocked. I have been to about three different stores and every one of them looks like this. They're packed lines and, and people are all over the place. It wasn't just the supermarkets that were busy ahead of the storm. Hardware stores across the state also were busy today. I've sold probably five or six snow blowers today, oil, gas cans, Snow blower shoes, shear pins, batteries, ice melt. Like it's just been, you know, everybody's been in today. It's been one of our busiest days in the last couple months. Larson Ace Hardware said a bunch of customers showed up for tune ups to ensure that their snow blowers would be able to tackle all the snow. And a lot of people who came in last minute couldn't start their snow blowers, so they needed stabilizer and spark plugs, but. Um, luckily, you know, this year we had everything that they would need. This store is so busy, only one shovel left. And this is the last one I have in the store. I don't have any in the garage. I don't have any downstairs. Um, Everybody is going to be prepared for tomorrow, um, luckily. While some are excited for the snow. We haven't had snow in a while, and I have a little grandson who is very excited to sled in snow to tomorrow morning. So um, we're, we're hoping to get just enough for the sledding. Everything else can stay up in the sky. Others are just trying to make it through the first snowstorm of the season. It's, you know, wintertime is not necessarily one of my favorite seasons, but uh, one that I deal with. And uh, we'll see what happens. And while everybody was out, uh, everyone was out earlier, the traffic here in downtown Waterbury has let up since we've been out here. We've seen a lot of people actually taking it on foot, walking the streets of downtown and coming out to the green to have those first uh, snowball fights of the season. We're live in Waterbury. Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's Newsday.